Good afternoon, people. I've had a wonderfully beautiful fucking day. So, first off, let's start with, apparently Jimmy is striking all my videos. No problem, because I don't have to put any more pictures up of them. Everybody's done seen the receipts. I can still tell stories, just like he does. Two, I did go to court this morning. <laughs> and it turned out beautifully in my favor. So now I have the preliminary protective order until we go to court in October. In addition to continuing that Mr. Williams cannot contact me by phone, text message, email, in person or anything. It was also granted due to Arkansas coming on my Facebook, trying to add me as a friend and trying to put my personal information out in Molly Golightly's chat. And with rapper Jay threatening me on Facebook or YouTube last night and admitting that Jimmy had paid him to come at me, I also have, in addition to that, is a third party no contact clause. So what that means, YouTube lawyers out there, is that if Mr. Williams sends any of his little trolls, minions, any of these little girls, whatever, that think there's something after me to contact me in email, on Facebook, on YouTube with any threats again, Mr. Williams is going to jail. So in addition to that third party clause, oh guys, God, this just gets better. It gets better, right? You couldn't think this day could get any better, but it does. So the judge has also since there's so much property that we've done because the relationship's been so long. I've been granted custody of Lolo. I do not have to return her. Um, they did want to give me his car. Every magistrate I've dealt with with this in Virginia Beach, in Chesapeake, the lady who did the paperwork this morning before I went in front of the judge, and the judge, the judge tried to talk me into taking the car and keeping the car. I said, Your Honor, I, I don't want it. I, I don't want it. I was with him when he bought it. The heat doesn't work. The tire makes a funny noise, noise when it drives. I think it's got a slow leak. And the engine kind of pings and knocks. Nah, I, I don't need a beater. He can keep the beater. Um, so I, I don't know what his record truly is. I, I know what the charges are, but I really don't know how many protective orders he has. So, I mean, they, they were just trying to hand me everything. So, we do go back to court in October. And so that was Lolo. No third party contact or Mr. Williams goes to jail. Mr. Williams goes to jail if he has any more of his minions come at me on my Facebook, on YouTube, threaten me, anything. He, he's getting locked up. And they told me, just remember, Miss Flanagan, go ahead, call 911. That's what we're here for. So in addition to that, I'm just going to wrap it up and just say after court was out, I jumped on 13 North, hooking up with my New York family and um, going to have a little fun. So I'd like to thank everybody out there for all the nice comments, all the support through this. I really appreciate it. It's been an interesting ride and I want to say thank you. Oh, one last thing. Now, I probably will be privating some of these videos for temporarily till I can blow out some faces because you know how Mr. Williams does, Jimmy does, Dolly does, Dirty D, I, I don't know, whatever you want to call him, little bitch man. Um, he wanted to strike every single video on my channel. You know how he plays. But, um... <laughs> Again, like I said, it was a good day. At the end of the day, I think I'm holding the upper hand because you know that burden of proof, that burden of proof to prove all of this, man, to some people that's just so hard. I just had too much when I went to court today. So everything came out in my favor. So all the people who say I kidnapped his dog and stuff like that, I had to show burden of proof that I have Lolo all the time. Not a problem. I had to show burden of proof that people were harassing me due to Mr. Williams. That wasn't a problem. So, Mr. Williams will be served tomorrow. So you hear that, Dolly, Jimmy? 
you're uh, you're getting served yet again tomorrow. And um, I'm just gonna go ahead and enjoy my evening with my family and friends, and uh, I hope y'all do too. Catch you next time.